Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Dragon Quest V. All right, we're back up here with uh, uh, these three holes, and uh, I think we might get some uh, more party talk with Bianca if we talk to her. Huh, I didn't expect to come all this way down, only to have to climb up all the way back up again. And let's go ahead and fall down, see where it takes us. To a new place! There is some more party talk that I can get with uh, Bianca, and kind of need to look around for it. What's this? Alt examines the treasure chest. What? A, a diamond! Kichigun acquires a diamond! A what? This gem can take the fall in place of its bearer. Oh, okay, so, uh... It gets destroyed rather than you dying. Got it. Which is kind of what I thought the Kamikaze Bracer did, but it doesn't. Alt examines the treasure chest. What? A seat of agility! Kichigun acquires the seat of agility! Alt examines the treasure chest. Uh-oh! The treasure chest is actually a canna box! Well, that's not all that worrying. Because it dies in two hits. Where does this go? Hi, monsters! Tox tongues? Alright. I did encounter one of these already, but, you know, they're kind of new otherwise. Percy's level increases to 32. Eight hit points. Uh, three strength, two agility, zero resilience, one wisdom, and luck. They're not recruitable as far as I know. <laughs> I've totally lost track of what level we're on after all that jumping about. Alright, there is some party talk that I want to get, and I think I need to go back this way to get it. There's so many stairs here, we're bound to get lost. That's fine, I got a map. Um, Ald, I think there's a chance I might be... Um, never mind. Just forget I said anything. Uh, are you, are you sure? Yeah, it's fine. Oh, okay. So all of these huge holes all over the place. If only there was some way of knowing which one, which of them leads to the way out. Well, actually, on here, all of them do. Yeah, all three of those lead right down here, so... It's not really that big of a deal. Alrighty, um, that should take us uh, just about out of here. Hello? I wonder if that man made it safely to where he was going or not. Uh, what man? It was a while back now, but a man called Sancho passed through here on his way to Gotha. Sancho? He seemed so sad and at a loss, and at a loss that he really struck a chord with me. Do you think... The Sancho could be our Sancho? We have to find out. Come on, all, let's hurry to Gotha. Okay. <laughs> well, that is Gotha. Before we go in there, let's wander around a little bit. Get some more uh, map revealing. And a stone golem appears. That is our first golem type enemy. I don't believe you can recruit the stone golems. Can recruit the Samaginas, so I would kind of like to. There's another enemy around here who should be pretty easy to recruit, and I'd like to get that taken care of. Speaking of... Hello, Mr. Orc King. Enemy are defeated. 360 experience points, and he decided not to join us. Yes, the Orc Kings are um, fairly easy to recruit, so I'll try to get one. Samagimas, less so. Enemy is too stunned to move. Let's go ahead and take care of these hex helmets. I did encounter these uh, on the other side of the mountains. Nice critical hit. None of them are recruitable, as far as I know. Where does this go? All right, let's go after the uh, ivory tusk tusks.
Bianca's level increases to 34. Four hit points, 11 MP, uh, zero strength, one agility, one wisdom, five luck, and zero resilience. Interesting note, there is some randomness here, because uh, um, I actually had her go up a level when I was looking around for the uh, exit, but then I got some of that party, party talk dialogue, and I wanted to show it off, because I believe it really only happens once. And uh, she got 6 luck, and I think only 10 MP. Interesting. You know, I really like chatting with you all. I had no idea how talkative I could be until I... Until you and I got together. I'm starting to get used to this man and wife lark. I hope we can keep on traveling together like this for a long while. Oh, I'm sure we will. Alright, there's a cave up here. We won't be going into the cave. More stone golems. Uh, one thing that I do not know is if using seeds in this game uh, reduces your level ups. Alright, another Orc King. You will join us, Orc King. You will do so. Seriously? <laughs> I've got you! I, I'll bring you back to life! <laughs> Percy just rips its face off. It's it, Well, it doesn't exactly have a face, but you know what I mean. Alright, well, this is not, uh... This is not Orc Kings. I want Orc Kings, please. Oh, Orc Kings... Wherefore art thou? No, you're not Orc Kings. Give me more Orc Kings, please. Don't step on me with your giant foot. It's rude. Where are all my Orc Kings at, damn it? No, oh, someone's going up a level. Uh, Vlad's level increases to 28. Uh, six hit points, one MP. I think that was six or was that eight? Whatever. Uh, three strength, two agility, resilience, and luck, and one wisdom. 105 gold coins. What is the point of this, l this bridge right here? Seriously. I mean, it's not exactly a bridge to nowhere, but it's pretty darn close. I mean, obviously it goes somewhere, but it's totally unnecessary. You could just take an extra ten seconds to go around the water. What's this? The Orc King get, gets up and looks over as if he wants to join the party. Allow the Orc King to join the party? Sure. It happily clambers into the wagon. But the wagon's full! Which party member do you want to send off to Monty, the monster monitor? Uh, so we've got Ward, the Orc King. Uh, I think that we will send off Blubba. Blubba heads back to the Monster Garden, and Ward joins the party. Just in case we uh, get into another... ...combat on the way. Might get more levels for uh, uh, Ward. <laughs> no, apparently not. Now, before we actually uh, explore the castle... Uh, I want to zoom back to Roundbeck, because there is a little scene that I missed. I think we can get that. I believe it is if we stay at the inn here. Oh, sorry, old. Did I wake you? It's just... I've been thinking a lot about things in the past. It's not that I'm feeling sad or nothing. It's all done and dusted now, I know that. Um, can I come over to you all? Sure, of course. You're my wife. You're gonna get into the bed? 
No. I want you to know I love you. Aww. That's so sweet. Okay. Now that we've gone into Gotha, we can uh, get back with another zoom. And in we go. All right. There's a little hut out there, but let's not go there yet. Let's explore the castle first. Bianca doesn't have anything to say. Wow. There's probably some folks here who know about you all. We should talk to as many of them as we can. Welcome to Gotha. Hearing them say that really brings it home to me that we've made it here to Gotha at last. Wow, this place is amazing. There's a whole town inside the castle walls. There's even a, a tree there. There's actual houses inside the castle. Not just inside the walls, but actually inside the castle. Seems like kind of a waste of space. Uh, we could get a shimmering dress for Bianca. Let's check to see if there's anything better before we do that. Uh, Silver Quirus is better for a Percy. Actually, let's not get that just yet. Uh, Dragon Mail is better for Ald and Gawain. This armor will reduce damage from fire-based attacks. The Tempest Shield can also be used as a tool during battle. And then the Iron Mask. I'm not sure if I really want this yet. I'm gonna... I'll, I'll buy one, but I'm not sure if I'll equip it yet. Or actually, Gawain takes a uh, substantially reduced damage from magic anyway. So, let's get one of these for uh, Gawain. Yeah, go ahead and reorganize. Okay, so it can be used as a tool during battle, I'll try to remember that. Uh, Dragon Mail, this armor will reduce damage from fire-based attacks. I'm currently wearing silver mail. Which doesn't appear to have any special effects. Let's get a suit of this for Gawain as well. Uh, let's see, the silver Quirus. No special effects. We'll go ahead and get that for Percy. And the Shimmering Dress. This diaphanous dress may reflect magic back at the caster. Uh, I'm not sure if that affects uh, healing spells too, though. But... <laughs> uh, I just realized that Bianca's carrying around a lot of rags. and sort all that stuff out. Bianca equips the Shimmering Dress. Uh, nope, we're good. Well, this is the castle town of Gotha. Our old king, King Pancras, was a very sharp ruler, you see. That's why he decided that all Gothans should live within the castle walls to protect us from our enemies. What enemies? Do you think King Pancras was really your dad, old? It's a bit hard to get your head around it, at, around it all, eh? Uh, no, I'm pretty sure. Ruff, 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 ruff. Percy gr growls at him. Good Percy. The stairs over there. Um, no, we don't need to stay right now. When I grow up, I'm going to be a soldier, and I'm going to guard Gotha to the end. My dad's a soldier. Soldiers are cool. They get to murder people indiscriminately. What a funny little boy. It could have been fun to take him along with us if he, if only he was a bit older. No, no, not really. Uh, kid's not really my thing. 
I hope the world's a more peaceful place by the time my little boy grows up. I second that. If I was a mum, I'd be saying the same exact thing. <laughs> Hello? All looks at the bookshelves. There don't seem to be any books of particular interest. All looks at the bookshelves. There don't seem to be any books of particular interest. Rude. Get some better books, sir. I was more of a fan of King Pancras and his brother Albert, to be honest. King Pancras had vision. He had dreams. Sadly, now we'll never know what those dreams were. But he had them, and that's what counts. I wonder what this Albert character's like. I'm starting to get a bit worried now. Oh, it'll be fine. He's my uncle after all, right? We had a long spell here without a king at all. He was away traveling, you see. We were all waiting for him to return, but, well, he never did in the end. Now his brother, Prince Albert, is our new king. He took the throne quite a few years ago now. Sounds like they all got tired of waiting for the old king to come home, eh? Yeah, kinda. It's very terrible of them. We'll have to murder them for their lack of faith. Nothing special. What? A tombola ticket! Alt acquires a tombola ticket! King Pancras dead? <laughs> I wouldn't... I don't believe a word of it. Every time I shut my eyes, I see his valiant figure standing proud and tall. So how can he possibly be gone, hmm? I can understand folk wanting to remember King Pancras, but they're going to have to, have to move on sooner or later. <laughs> don't mind me. What's a seed of wisdom? Alt acquires a seed of wisdom. What kind of uh, plants are producing these anyways? There was once a master craftsman who lived here in the castle, you know. Known as a god among jewelers, he was. But after King Pancras left the castle, he left too. His son still lives here, though. He runs the weapon shop upstairs. Craftsman, eh? It's funny that he left the castle like that. He must have been ever so attached to King Pancras. What do you got for sale? Uh, Chimera Wing, Rock Bomb Shard, Pax a Punch, Scale Shield, Fur Hood, and a Tortoise Shell. I guess we just need some basic equipment for some of your uh, monsters. 10,000 G reward to be paid to anyone who locates King Pancras and Queen Mata by order of the King. I think I will be deserving that pretty soon. What a seat of strength! All acquires a seat of strength! What a mini medal! Nobody acquires a mini medal! What a TNT ticket! Bianca acquires a TNT ticket! That's another day Mr. Sancho hasn't been in. I wonder what's happened. He used to come to church and to pray every single day. Mr. Sancho's getting on a bit now, I suppose. We better f try and find the Sancho character a bit sharpish. Come on. If it's the same Sancho as our Sancho, I'll bet he was in the church the whole time praying you'd be safe, old. Ah, he lost faith. I'm not sure if we want someone like that with us. Well, we can go up these stairs. I was instructed by King Pancras, the former king, to research the legendary castle of a place known as Zenithia. But the problem is, now that his majesty is no longer around, I don't know if there's any point in continuing my research. Research in Zenithia, eh? King Pancras was certainly a man of many secrets. Well, I mean, he was looking for the Zenithian equipment. There don't seem to be any books of particular interest. There's a book called The Rookie's Guide to Winning at Chess. Ald takes it from the shelf and has a closer look. First, flip over the board if you lose. It's full of detailed strategies that each spans several pages. Rookie's Guide, eh? Nothing of interest there. And nothing of interest there. Hello, world map. And whole continent that we have not been to yet. Uh, let's see, so there's a whole continent that we haven't been to yet. There's an island that we haven't been to yet. 
Oh, and I guess technically the central continent we haven't been to yet either. Uh, but I believe we've been to the entire northern continent, the entire eastern continent, both north and south, southern continent, and now we have access to most of this continent over here. There's a couple of... There's really just, I think, one tiny island outside. So there's a big continent, a little I a large island or a little continent, and then a tiny island out there. No, we haven't been to yet. Really not that many places left to go. There don't seem to be a whole lot of uh, um, cities on the outer sea that have ports and stuff. Hello, slime. Don't beat me to a pulp. I'm gooey enough as it is. And, and I'm not a bad slime, you know? Really, I promise. It's a long time ago now, but I un I oozed to be Queen Modest Pet Slime once. Oh. You can be uh, Bianca's Pet Slime. I mean, Kijigun isn't a pet. Kijigun is a friend. Let's see, get get up the stairs, <laughs> fool. She has wings. All well, looks at the bookshelves. There don't seem to be any books of particular interest. You are travelers, I believe. I too roamed the world prior to my arrival here in Gotha. King Pancras was most kind and helpful. But were not for the fate befallen unto Madalena, I have no doubt King Pancras would still be... No, I have said too much. Such vain wishes shall not bring him back. Did you see that? She has wings on her back. Do you think they were real? Just what kind of a character was she? That is, uh... Quite strange indeed. Uh, before we go up the central stairs, let's see if uh, Bianca has anything to say about our little slime friend. Sounds like Queen Mata was a lot like you if she was the sort to keep her slime as a pet. <laughs> well, except I don't, I don't keep monsters as pets. You say anything different? Nope. In here are the soldiers' quarters. Castle staff only, I'm afraid. That's a shame. Don't look like we're going, going to get any further this way. Well, maybe we can find a, uh, a back way in. I, I see that up there. It will be mine. Oh, hello. We can go in here. Oh, bother, I lost it again. Thruppence is just too good for me, I suppose. Hmm, what am I talking about? What's everyone talking about? Monster chess, of course! Everyone's crazy about it at the moment! The Chancellor found all these chess pieces in the vault recently, you see. Ever since then, all of a, all the soldiers have been completely hooked on it. It's all we can think about now. Do you know how to play? Uh, I, I do. Technically. I haven't played chess in... Probably over 20 years. Really? When did you learn that? Oh, right. Pancras taught you when you were little, eh? I guess. <laughs> I remember all those day long days I stood here waiting for King Pancras to return. Then finally one day I spotted Mr. Sancho approaching the castle. Can't tell you how happy I was to see him. However many times and however hard I looked, King Pancras wasn't with him. Can't tell you how sad I was not to see him. The more things we hear, the harder it is to forget. We're here in your birthplace, eh, Ald? <laughs> Alright, doesn't look like there's a whole lot else to do out here. Other than talk to you people. Anything over here? No. Okay. Mistress Gertrude doesn't listen to a word I say. 
I never asked to be a princess. It's only because my father's become king of Gotha. It doesn't matter what I think. I don't have any say in it. It's not fair. I just want to play. She's got a bit of a mouth on her, but being a princess alone is enough to impress me. I'm sorry. The only people allowed to enter here without express permission from the king are members of the royal family. You're not royalty, are you? Uh... Yes? Ha 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 ha! Nice try. That's a good one. Someone like you, royalty. Ha ha ha! Can't prove it yet, eh? He'll be in for a shock when he finds out you are royalty, though. This is the king's chamber, but his majesty is resting at the moment. I must ask you to come back at another time. And Bianca doesn't have anything to say about that. <laughs> Alright, well that's most of the castle that we can get to uh, explored at the moment. There is a little building outside, but I think we will take a look at that in the next episode. Let's see what, uh, what happens to be in there. See you then, everyone.